So I do see your old eczema. Yes. You know, you still have... My patient came in with severe eczema since childhood, never went away, in fact, got worse over time. Red, scaly, cracked, oozing skin, virtually from head to toe. Couldn't go out and play as a child. I was very self-conscious. Eczema affects anywhere from 10 to 20% of the population. A very, very common disease. All therapies up to this point, whether it's topical steroids or uh, other newer drugs that are coming out, really try to suppress the immune system. And that's been the traditional strategy. We've actually taken a very different approach. And we thought, why don't we actually try to boost another part of the immune system, and namely natural killer cells or NK cells, which has really been shown to be very important in fighting off viruses. Well, how did we make the link? Patients with eczema actually have a lot of trouble fighting out viral infections in the skin. So the idea here is to really just boost NK cells and then bring the immune system back in balance. And in fact, that's what we did. And we showed in mice definitively that this actually improves eczema. So we think that this might be an alternative treatment strategy for patients with eczema in the clinic. It's actually a short leap to take this into humans. Um, so really, there are already drugs out there that are in development. So we could either use one of those drugs or even design our own drug to boost this. Every, literally every single day, I'm like, is it going to come back? Is it going to come back? And really? Like, daily? I've been treating eczema for a very long time. And it wasn't until actually we were able to get patients dramatically better, especially those with severe disease, that I came to recognize how much it was really affecting their lives. Patients could finally get out in public for the first time, go about and do, doing the things that they always wanted to do, that they were afraid to do.